Yo, what's going on, dudes and dudettes? Welcome back to all the mods. Eight hardcore guys, we're back in the other, and I've discovered something. I went here to try to test it, and look what's in here. The pig liches can go in the mob and pr oh, we gotta go get him. All right, so yeah, we have a. A piglet in here. He took 50 damage. That's okay. Um, I didn't think I would be able to do that. We've got a couple more over here. And I believe the piglitches spawn in guys around them. Um, so we might end up doing something in the uh, end today. So let's head on back. And let's see here. Can I grab you? No. Oh, I grabbed that one. You? Oh, I got him. Okay. So I'm going to take these guys. And we're going to see if we can do something fun with them. Um, I don't think there's any more in here. I did go through and clear out all the spawners a while ago. Okay, there's one more. Okay, so there's something I want to go ahead and do here real quick. Um, we do have a piglet here, and so I want to make a mob duplicator to see if this will actually work. Um, now, if I'm not mistaken, uh, my Game Boy is on me, yes. If we go... I need to turn my magnet off real fast. If we go oh, in here, I, oh my, I might need to add in some more of those kill chambers and some more item pickup. That's a lot, but we, this is what we're looking for here. So green lime green. Okay. Let's get out of here. That's a lot of mobs. Um, okay, so tank. Oh, check it out. We do have one. Cool beans. Okay, we need a flux point. I don't have any more. I should really just make like, a whole bunch of them, but I don't. Okay, so I don't really want to spawn one in there. I figured maybe here would be pretty good. Okay, so place this here. It needs essence why is it empty hang on okay i got it we just had to grab the exp uh, crystal thing here but now this should be filling up Yes. Okay. So if we do this and give it power. Can it? No. Hmm. Hmm. Dang it. Interesting. Also, what happens if we bring him out? I don't think he likes me. <laughs> uh, okay. I guess that didn't work. Okay. So what happens if we do this and sip? Sam. Nope. You, you can't sample him. Okay. Okay. So I know what we must do. We need this destruction gadget, which destroys items. And we're gonna make a mob crusher. And we need a bunch of vector plates because we are gonna be farming. We're gonna be farming these guys. And we're gonna be throwing them around. <laughs> it sounds crazy when I say it out loud. Uh, but yeah, we need quite a few of these. Um, so, and the, the best vector plates 
If we use these, uh, it should kind of toss them, so we shouldn't have to really uh, worry too much about them. Because the, the piglets should keep spawning in. I need to know how to use this. Let's see. Uh oh. Oh. Um, I've never used this tool before. We got another pig glitch. Yeah, they're spawning back in, which is good. So let's see. Shift click. Depth. 16. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay. Yes. Good. I need to make sure I don't void the wrong part. Oh, this might be tough. Well, we'll get it close. We're just going to start clicking. I don't know if that was a good idea. That might have been a really bad idea. Why did I do that? I promise. I think sometimes. I wonder if it would just be easier to just vein mine stuff. Because my pickaxe is pretty quick now. I was wondering if it'd be easier just to do this. Okay, I'm gonna clear out this place. Does it matter how I clear it out? No, not really. Um, anyway, I'll be back. This is fun. Yes. All right, so we've got this place cleared out. The pig liches are definitely spawning in, which is gonna be amazing. Uh, but they are spawning in stuff around them. So I'm wondering if Maybe we can grab some mega torches and lay those down because I think I have a few here. Yeah, cool. And then I also need to fill in the bottom. So, oh, we want that time in a bottle. What block do I have a lot of? <laughs> cool thing is we have this guy. Uh, so we're going to put one back, and we're just going to do it stone. So wand, cool beans. All right, and then this is the level we're going to want to fill them in at. Eventually, we'll probably come back and turn this all into stone. Oh, I need to do the mega torches real quick so the blaze stops spawning and wrecking me. So I'll do one here. Do one here. We have a, a like a two block wall retaining wall around everything, which is cool. Okay. Okay, so we got this place all squared away. Um, well, actually not entirely squared away. Uh, so I got these guys to do. But, oh, well, that'll be fine. Yes, as you can see, it looks pretty good. Uh, we're just gonna be kind of moving these guys into here. There's a lot of them below me right now that I need to kind of bring up, which is kind of a bummer. But we need to do this. I'm going to place these guys along the edge here. Yeah, okay. So these get moved pretty quickly. And I want to see how far it is 
that we can place these. So one, two, three, let's say four. All right, let's grab this guy for a test. So if we put him here. Okay, I think he just died. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that killed him instantly. We got a crossbow. Hmm. This might not be good. Um. Do we not get... Oh boy. Let's grab two more. Oh. Oh no. This is bad. Okay, so here we go. We kind of have the the farm pretty much set up. We just need to come down here. Sorry if it's dark. And we start grabbing some of these guys. Um And we're just going to test Oh, I let him back out. There we go. Okay. So let's see here if we do get any piglet hearts. Okay. <laughs> okay, so it is gonna work. Um, I just need to make sure no mobs can spawn down here. Oh, wait a second. I think this is going to affect the pig liches. These mega torches. Well, it was really nice when it was when I was building it. So this is going to work. It's just going to be extremely tedious getting these guys from down here to up there. I might have to mob proof it down here, which would be terrible. Yeah, because I think a lot of them are within this wall. Maybe I just set up the um, the mob farm down there real quick. Oh my gosh, we're up to three. Yeah, let's just set up the mob farm real quick to take them out. Here we go. Put those in here. Yep, there we go. We're doing good. Really need some night vision. <laughs> All right, it seems to be working. Um, while not extremely fast, um, they do spawn in, uh, which is good. Um, yeah, I'm trying to see what the proper height is that I should probably do this. Um, see if I can get them to come this way. That worked. Both of them. Yeah, we're still having mobs kind of spawn down below. So I do need to mob, mob proof below this. But if I get to a certain spot... 
they should spawn in. Yeah, see, we got some more over there. So I think this is like a prime time spot, but we are getting pig lich hearts, which is fantastic. Look at that, we have a total of 14 now. We're also getting all the modium armor and piglet's charm fragments, which is really cool. So, but yeah, I just need to go AFK here for a bit and we'll get some piglet's hearts. I might just make like a whole case of the uh, glass. Let me see here. Yeah, the ethereal glass. Might just make a whole little container for myself. But yeah, we're gonna pump all this right into our ME system. So that's pretty lit. Yeah, look at that, we got a couple there. And we can always make this more uh, faster by you know putting more of the, the vector plates in. Um, this is just a general one to get started. So yeah, it's really, really good. So we're gonna push out the back. And if we check here, items should be going in. All right, so I just put ouch, just put a little pipe here. We're getting shot at by blazes, but yeah, this is working really good. Those piglet heart hearts are going into our system. I still don't know where or how high I should go for these guys to just spawn in. I might need to look up some kind of thing, but like that guy just spawned in down there. So I figured some of them might spawn in. Yeah, look at that. A lot spawned in, holy cow, okay. Maybe I go up a couple blocks above this guy. Oh yeah, it's working pretty good. So check this out. I did set up a little AFK platform a little bit above. I tried two different spots. Oh, this guy's out here. Excuse you. Thank you so i can actually go ahead and get rid of this bottom one um again that was just a a test oops caps locks are on oops missed the button there we go so really cool um yeah i think i'm gonna take this um we're gonna move it up here cool Actually, I'm gonna put a torch on top of it. There we go. But yeah, this thing has been working on. Oh my gosh, look at the amount of them. I think I'm definitely gonna add in more of the vector plates. I think that'd be a good idea, um, just so it's faster. But yeah, I mean, it's been working really good. I need to go AFK here for probably a couple hours um just so we can get enough because let's let's go on up over to the afk platform if we look here for the all the modium star um yeah we need a lot we need one two three four five six seven eight nine wait hang on one two three four five six seven eight We need 28 of these uh, all the modium alloy, unobtainium all the modium, and then we need. Okay, so we don't need any pig glitches for those, but we do need some nether star blocks. So I need to get the the wither farm back up and running. And yeah, so we got a lot of these guys to do like a pulsating black hole. We need this from. Uh, pneumatic craft, which should theoretically be easy, but then we need antimatter from industrial contraptions. Um, we need a nuke. We need antimatter from mechanism. 
so like we that, that's why we got a mechanism a little bit ago but um yeah this is one of the the big items so we're gonna kind of work our way in um but yeah i'll go afk here for a bit and we'll see what we're gonna do for the rest of the episode Okay, so for the remainder of the episode, I think we're going to go ahead and work on the Wither Nether Star production. Um, yeah, I think we're going to move it out from in one of the compact machines because this just isn't working. So, whoops. Yeah, I'm going to take. Uh, let's see, we don't need those. I think I really just need these. Oh, there's our mob. Oh, we have two mob crushers in here. That would have been handy. Oh, oh well. We'll use this for something else. But for some reason, the Wither Builder does not work in there. Um, so what I'm going to go ahead and do is I have a bunch of elevator blocks. And we are going to go down from here. And we're going to go but probably down to bedrock, like one level above. And we're gonna build a room where we're gonna have four wither builders all going. So yeah, but first we need to set it up so that the items are going to get exported properly. So let's see, did I only grab, oh, I only grabbed one, frick. Oh, there it is. Perfect. Okay, so we're going to set up the automation for this guy. These guys. Okay, so we are down here, Y level negative 55. And the really cool thing, check this out. It takes us all the way up here. Uh, yeah, that's over 100 block. That 100 blocks that we're going up with the elevator. So, yeah, that's, that's really cool. <laughs> but yeah, so this is essentially what we're going to be doing here. Um... Let's grab some of the wither builders. We're going to be putting one of these in each corner. Um, and yes. So this is the floor. Um, and then these are going to be the walls right here on the back. I'm going to reinforce all of these blocks, by the way. This is where the uh, killing chamber thing is going to be. Let me put it on the front. Mm, let's put it in the back. So, like that, and then it's going to get power from below. We're going to put the Wither Builder here, boom, like that. All right, and then we're just going to connect it up to power. Should we go like this? Set that to our home network. And then click, click. So now this guy should have power. Yep. This guy should have power. Yep. Cool. All right. Now we need to reinforce the blocks. Okay. So. Well, the, oh, these blocks don't work in that. Darn. That would have looked good. Okay. Can they do Skystone? Nope, can't do Skystone. Hmm. I guess we'll just do stone bricks for now. Okay, so here we'll just kind of surround it. Maybe we'll see about putting something cool 
on the front here. Okay. Okay, so the Wither Builder is good to go. I am going to need to make some more of the Ender Chests here, but we'll get one set up and I can do the other ones off camera. That's no problem. Um, so here. And here. Oh, not the same one. Here and here. And then we just need an item pipe. I think we actually only need one per side. Yeah, like so. Oh, we also need the timer, okay. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that this is now set up. Um, all we gotta do, we can actually break this block here. Actually, we can't because that's the reinforced one. We'll have to sneak around, but that's also reinforced. Wither Builder, good to go. Um, the Mob Crusher, uh, the one thing we actually need to do is put oops i don't have it we need to put this guy and we also need a range upgrade yeah we'll use this guy okay so right now working area is only there Put the range add on it's actually we don't need it even to be that big but we'll keep it that one for now um, and then this should be far away so that we don't see what oh here okay we'll just put him or them there shebang bow okay so now that's going to take items out of here and it's going to put them into this very cool so now these are all wither proof we need to grab the weatherproof glass, the tinted glass. And this should be it. Um, we also could put some light in there. It doesn't need, I think the tinted glass is just weatherproof. Yeah, it doesn't need to be dark in there. We just, it's really inexpensive. So let's see. Um, yeah, we'll do one of these. gives it a kind of a cool look honestly this doesn't look half bad um, yeah I like that okay we'll fill these in in a second now all we need to do is set these to pull in Pull in. Hmm. Maybe it does want it to just be a separate side. There we go. Nice, okay. And it should be killed pretty quickly.
Uh oh. Um, the mob crusher exploded. Okay, so I made a mistake. You're supposed to put the mob crusher on the outside of the farm, which is something I didn't do. So that's why it exploded. Um, but yeah, we'll go ahead and put the wither builder back. Good thing is we have, uh, we found out we have uh, two spare wither things. Um, run on redstone pulse. That's what we want. Okay. So now this should be good. Should have a wither built now. There we go. Oh, it doesn't have the range upgrade. Okay, so I've got the range add-on in here now. Uh, we just need to push this to the top. There we go, it's working. Okay. So that's gonna build the wither. Alrighty. the wither oh and there it goes okay so I need to put a speed upgrade in there so that it runs faster and we do have one cool so yeah there we go this should help us out a lot I gotta wait again. Okay, so we're getting to the end of this weather being built. There it goes, and it's gone. Perfect. And then the next one's built. Cool, the only problem I just realized is that if we come up here, you can still see the bar because it's below us. I'm not too sure what to do about that. Um, maybe put on some kind of resource pack that doesn't show this. Maybe that's our, our best bet. But uh, anyways, we're gonna wrap up the episode for today. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please make sure to hit that like button. And as always, guys, don't forget to subscribe. But this has been Super Turtle, and I'll see you all in the next video. Take care, peace out, bye-bye.